Kanakpura road and those students who would have already given you know PGCET so they will know the code so this is called this college offers MBA and MCA both of these courses and you can see the code for them and also uh, if you want to get in touch with for the admissions you can contact this helpline number which is below so that is the information you can you know review upon and i have done a lot of videos on dsatm so these three are the videos you can find about the dc dsatm mba review and you can also find the engineering comet k review for dsatm college and also the comparison of dsatm with respect to the other Dhanan Sagar group uh, colleges, you know, which are like a Dhanan Sagar College of Engineering, DSCE and DSU, which is the Dhanan Sagar University. So anybody who is looking for MBA engineering can refer to those uh, videos, right? So let's start with the fees. So I will first start with the uh, government quota seat for MBA. So this is uh, government quota through MBA, uh, government quota seat for MBA. And you see the first column, which is a tuition fee and university fees. Total put together is 58,470. So it is basically 50,000 plus 7,000, sorry, 8,470, which is which is VTU fees. And total you have to pay 58,470. Then when once you are going to join your college, you have to pay the column four, right, which is the college fees. So this college fees also has a three structure. You can see right for Karnataka students 35,979. The, you have to pay 2000 more around 1500 rupees more if you are an outside Karnataka student and you, if you are outside India that is you are an NRI then you have to pay 47,479 as a college fee. So college fee is changing from Karnataka to non-Karnataka to NRI quota and all of these college fees have to be given to uh, you know college in the with the, as a DD in the favor of you know Dhanan Sagar Academy of Technology and Management payable at Bangalore right so once you are starting this process this is the total fees it will come for the MBA as a government seat right now somebody who is interested also to join this college under the management quota fees then this is the fees applicable management quota fees is 2,32,000 so this is the management fees equivalent to tuition fees which was 58,000 there and after this 2,20,000 fees, you also have to pay additional college fees. So college fees you have seen in the previous sheet, right? So there were three types of college fees. One for the Karnataka students, one for the uh, non-Karnataka students and one for the NRI students. So the management quota total fees is equal to this 2,32,000 plus college fees. So for college fees, again, go back and refer to those three depending on where you come from, right? So this is MBA program I have covered. Now coming for the MCA student, right? So MCA student, this is the fees for MCA student who are coming from the government quota, right? So the government quota seats are much cost effective. And here you see the, uh, the tuition and the university fees for MCA student is also the same as that of the MBA student, right? Which is 58,470. And after that, you have to pay the college fees also. The fourth column is the college fees. So here you see uh, th there are three type of college fees. One is for the Karnataka students 32,379. Another one for the non-Karnataka students which is 33,879. Right? And the last one is that of the NRI students who is coming from outside India. So they have to pay the college fee of 43,879 right? for, st for student studies outside India. right? So this three type of government seat will will have this type three type of college fees you have to uh, give and the DD has to be named in the name of the Sagar Academy of Technology and Bangalore, right? So now coming to the management fees part of uh, MCA, right? So for both the programs MBA and MCA, if you are taking through management quota, anyway you would have written either the PGCET or the KMAT exam, right? And you would have that scorecard. So you are also requested to take all those scorecards and or KMAT scorecards along with this set of documents for uh, you know admission process and the fees for MCA for the management quota is about one lakh seventy thousand right so you can see again this one lakh seventy thousand is the tuition fee equivalent and the rest of the things which is the college fee uh, which I have shown for the three different type of students in the previous sheet all those students have to give the college fees also depending on their from Karnataka, non-Karnataka or outside India, right? And the documents are sets are there. So hope you got the complete information uh, about, uh, you know, the both the MBA, MCA and uh, government and the management quota seats. So please do like and subscribe this uh, channel. I'll, I'll going to share more details about other colleges as well.